Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome to Estadio da Luz where Portugal is about to host Swedish national team. This is a World Cup qualifying playoff stage and it is a very crucial game for the both sides whereas we could not imagine the World Cup without Portugal or Sweden and now please listen to the national anthems of the teams. So yes, everything is set to begin, as it will be a tough battle between Cristiano Ronaldo and Zlatan Ibrahimovic, two top-class strikers, two absolute geniuses of football. As you can see, the guest sector is fully filled. The home side is taking picture, but but in their minds, it is all about the football. Match officials going to be Conor O'Connolly from Republic of Ireland. As a starting lineup for Portugal, Rui Patricio, Jorge Pereira, Pepe, Bruno Alves, Fabio Coentro, Miguel Veloso, João Moutinho, Raul Meirelles, Vieirinha, uh, Elder Postiga, and Cristiano Ronaldo up front. The starting lineup of Sweden: Isaksson, Lustig, Kantensen, Nilsson, Olsson, Kachaniklic, and Vernblom, Svensson, Larsson, and Ibrahimovic up front. 4-5-1 is a tactical scheme for the wayside. Everything is set for the kickoff. And here we go as the fans are cheering up, crowd is fired up and the local fans are waiting for the victory and Swedish fans are waiting for the goal and the way goal it may be very crucial in this encounter. Now Nilsson passes it back to Antonsson, Swenson to the left it's also on both sides are with the strongest lineup, no injury concerns whatsoever. In the midfield, it's Wernblom to the left, Olsen, Swenson, Larsen, Ibrahimovic, the main player for the wayside. And near the penalty area, it's Ibrahimovic, he shoots, but Joao Moutinho blocks well. He finds Elder Pushtiga, Cristiano, Pushtiga again, Raul Meirelles finds Vieirinha, who plays for a Portuguese side Porto. Not the best team to be seen in this stadium as Benfica is Porto of the best rivals in the league. Fabio Coentrao, the player of Real Madrid, alongside with Pepe and Ronaldo, now Meirelles. In the midfield, he finds João Pereira, who plays it back to João Moutinho. Bit pressure from Portuguese, but Swedish players organized well back. Cristiano Ronaldo, João Moutinho, Nilsson. Great sliding tackle to demoralize Portuguese player. Ibrahimovic, the only player that is up front for the Swedish side. Kachaniklic finds Elm. Now Ibrahimovic, great pass to the left, he finds Larsson. Larsson, a bit in trouble as two Portuguese players are in front of him. And João Moutinho gets back to play well in defensive line. Pepe, the strong man in the center back. He's gonna cover Ibrahimovic, but air balls will be the main priority for the tall man. Big man from Sweden, Wernblom to the left, Olsen. Bad pass as Joao Pereira made a mistake. Larson crosses it in, and Bruno Alves is there to neutralize Ibra. Elm once again, Swedish applying a bit pressure on Portugal. Swanson to the right is Lustig. Great technical skills. Swanson again. Antonsen. Nielsen in the midfield. All Swedish team is now on the Portuguese side, but the host managed to intercept the ball. Now Moutinho to the right. Joao Pereira, 25 minutes played, still nil-nil. Still a bad luck. Very tight encounter. Nobody knows who will qualify. Dead even teams. Larson, Alum, Swenson. 
to the left. It's Wernblum. Ibrahimovic passes back to Olsen. Ibra again. And it should be offside. And it is as Wernblum was caught here. Yep. Great defensive play from the Portugal. It should be said that Ronaldo scored 24 goals. Unbelievable statistic for one of the best players in the world. While Ibrahimovic scored 14 goals in the last 8 matches. So both of these players are on top of their form. Isakson has no trouble of picking up that ball. As 34 minutes played, still 0-0. Antonsen finds Elm. Bad pass. Veloso plays to Moutinho. Mayrelish finds Cristiano. Could be dangerous. Passing percentage 95 to 91 for Portugal. Nobody wants to risk as it offside. Rome Relish was a bit too fast in previous episode. Swedish took a free kick. Lustig. Elm. Kacchaniklic on the right hand side. Bad play from Swedish as Portuguese throwing the ball in. Bruno Alves was the reason why Portugal got knocked out in the Euro 2012 against Spanish. You could remember when Bruno Alves made the penalty. Now it's Portugal. Virinha. Can he cross it in? No. He holds two players against him. Moutinho. Passes to Mireles. Good pass towards Contrao. He finds Cristiano. Great technical skills from Ronaldo. Could he win Ballon d'Or this September? We'll see. We'll have to wait to find out. Elm, great interception. Goes for. Finds Ibrahimovic. Great play. Wernblum. Seemed to be right choice. But defenders are there. Pepe was there to intercept the ball. And again throw in for Portugal. Last minute of the first half. Still 0-0. Still everything to pray for. Cristiano Ronaldo finds Veloso. 1-2 there. And the first half is finished. 0-0. We'll have to wait for the second half. If we want to see goals. Okay. We're back in action. Swedish. Restart the game. Ibrahimovic goes by himself. There's so much talent in this player, so much potential. That head coach of the Swedish national team trusted him the most. Virinha. João Moutinho plays to the center. Miguel Veloso finds Mayrelesh. He plays to the left. Fabio Cointrao. Bad pass, Lustig intercepts, a potential of quick counter-attack by Sweden, great pass towards Ibrahimovic, but as usual he's in offside. Yep, he was. Pepe played great to come a bit up and make a trap for Ibra. Now Sweden, Wernblum, bad pass again, Joao Pereira is there to intercept. To the right. Now Vierinha. No substitute made in a half time. Both coaches that are satisfied with their starting lineup. Isaksan has no trouble of catching that ball. He sent it long towards Ibrahimovic. And he fouls. And here we go. First substitution as Kallstrom comes on for Swanson. Kallstrom plays for Spartak Moscow. Joe Moutinho. Kacchaniklic, great sliding tackle, Ibrahimovic, quick counter attack by Sweden, could it be? Now Kacchaniklic decided to play it back, Olsson, Wernblom, another player from CSK Moscow this time, a lot of players from Russia, and Miguel Veloso comes up for Custodio, we'll see how it goes, Custodio is an attacking type of player, Kastrom plays well, Ibrahimovic in front of box, Wernblom to the right, finds Lustig. Great play from Cristiano Ronaldo, who demoralized Swedish player now in Portugal. Go quick, Mayrelish. 
passes it towards his teammate, but Swedish play well in defensive line. Elm Ibrahimovic, one two. Wernblum picks it up. Elm again, no offside. Elm may he cross it in. Now he finds Gotcha Niklas. Who crossed it in? But Bruno Alves, another great play in the air from Bruno Alves. Virinia finds Helder Postiga. Great pass towards Cristiano, but Antonsson is there to intercept. Cristiano gets it back. Wernblum, great, great defensive play from Sweden they organized well and it's very tough for Portuguese to break it Ibrahimovic plays well uses his strength and it's Rui Patricio who handles the ball I should say that Ibrahimovic should not cross the ball in he should be the main target to head the ball in to head the ball towards the goal from the crosses and then Swedish may have a chance of scoring the ball. But Pepe and Bruno always play great in the penalty area. Now Raul May relish finds Postiga. It could be dangerous here. Show Boutinho, Postiga, one there for Portugal. They open the score in 74th minute. Alder Postiga. What an unselfish play from Joao Moutinho. To provide an assist for Postiga, who had only to shoot it in an open goal. So Portugal breaks the deadlock. It's 1-0. Crowd is going absolutely wild. Now the advantage on Cristiano's team side. 15 minutes to go. Can Ibrahimovic equalize this? Lustig from the right. Plays towards Larson. And the whole Portuguese side is now on the own half defending these attacks from Scandinavians. Nielsen. Ah. But Custodio gets it back. Raul May Relish. Finds Elder Postiga. Great pass towards Virinha, but it was offside. Let us see that again. Yep. 3-4 yards offside, that was Villarina, and another substitution is going to be made by the coach of Portugal. We are seeing Villarina, and Nani comes on for Villarina as Larsen is substituted by Zengen. Nani, an experienced player from Manchester United, is a very technical and fast player, can provide brilliant assists, but we'll see how it goes. Karlström to the left. 82nd minute of the game. Wernblum 1 2 with Kaciniklic. Trouble with handling the ball. Now also crossed it in. Ibrahimovic was the target, but Pepe played great to neutralize Swedish big man. Cristiano makes a mistake. Wernblum near the area. To the left he plays. Olsen. Elm. Crossed that in, but unfortunately for him, the ball crossed the line. It's going to be a goal kick for Portugal. Another substitute will come on in Portugal as Raul Mireles comes off and Ruben Mikhail comes on. It's a positional substitution for Portugal. Maybe strategic one to slow down the tempo. As 1-0 is the result that satisfies them the most in current circumstances. Custodio finds Ruben Mikael, João Moutinho to the right, João Pereira. Great back heel to João Moutinho. Trouble of receiving the ball, Kachaniklis is there to pick it up. One minute of added time, 1-0 for Portugal. Can Sweden equalize it? Wernblum in the center. Elm finds Ib Zengen on the right. But Bruno always intercepts it and it be all over for Sweden as Portugal takes home advantage with goal from Elder Pustig on 74th minute. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to our channel, like this video, so on. Good luck to y'all guys.